My name, my name is Osama de Amorogi. You can call me Ozzy. I'm a super heavyweight boxer. I'm boxing out of the Fitzroy Lodge, and today I'm going to claim the London ABA title and my weight. Look out for me. Hi everyone, welcome to Boxing Blog Center, the home of Nigerian African Boxing. Please, if you're new to the channel, make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button right there. And also go to the notification bell icon, click it. And sell all so in terms of dropping your bag on the US because video, you'll definitely be notified. Who is Osame De Omorege K OZ? You know, a top sparring partner of Anthony Joshua. A top one of the top amateur uh heavyweight uh fighters in the uk of course being an Nigerian himself you can tell that this guy has got the heart of a lion you know so osama de amorigi x66 physically you know in shape mentally strong you kind of wonder that looking at the rosters you know looking at the uk right now the boxing scene in the uk they've got a lot of a lot of you know upcoming monsters who are, whose name are not yet even known to the public i mean i watched a fight of uzi you know some fights of him in the amateur and you can tell that this guy's jab is very solid he's got a great jab his, his, his movement is of course on point for a very big guy you know he uses his reach very well and he's got a tremendous right hand I remember <laughs> you know seeing him hit uh, Jonathan Palota with that right hand damn it Palota almost like was almost out so Ozzy is one of those guys that's going to dominate every division if he's well, you know, managed and of course promoted. If you were to turn pro tomorrow, for example, who would he sign to? Probably at the end of Matro Boxing because he's a top dog. But Frank Warren, of course, is a good. Frank Warren already has some heavyweights in his roster. We've got the likes of Jojo is there. And of course, uh, the dangerous prospect david adele also there tyson fury mm, no longer with or partly with uh, frank warren so i can't really vouch for him if he's already gone now in my trip so you've got some like uh, nathan goma there and some other fighters you know so it's not bad um him being an Nigerian, uh you know you know what he brings to the table Nigerians are very strong species and being you know so that that lion heart is already there and in fact for Joshua to like bring you to sparring you know like to his camp for sparring you know like not just once but multiple times it shows that he's got a great thing you know that he had to Joshua's training and taking and all those stuff and I just can't wait to see, you know, Nigerian uh, fighters um, worldwide. When I say worldwide, I mean fighters of Nigerian descent, you know, as well like Joshua, first to call it the rest. I just can't see them do shine on the, on, 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 like, I just can't wait to see their name come a household name. Joshua is already a household name in many, many countries. So Coley is getting there, you know. Joe Joyce is getting there. If your Jaguar is getting the if it to is getting the Israel Desoyan is already household name in Nigeria, New Zealand, in America. I don't know in America, but most places in America, you know. Of course, Kamaru Usma already household name for sure in Nigeria and um, America and uh, yes, in other countries as well. Like so many fighters from Nigeria, that I can't even mention. Oh no, they were also them. I can just wait to see was next for 
Osamede or Moregi, aka Ozi the Beast. This guy was cut out with the mission. I tell you that. Stay with this guy, stay on the ball, and shake him out.